Uh, it's okay. And if you want on my phone, if you need to like send anything to anybody. <laughs> yeah, they just want to let them know that I'm alive and yeah. actually. In this weather. In this weather, yeah. yeah. And then, so that's the Welcome to Virginia sign. Oh. So in every state, they say like, welcome to whatever state you're at. Yes. Yeah. They, this one yeah. right there. Oh. Uh -huh. Um, yeah, so when you, if you ever, like, if you go to California and you, like, go to, like, Nevada yeah. or, um, Oregon, it, it'll say, like, welcome to whatever state you're crossing yeah. to. Yeah. Oh. And they all have, like, little songs. The streets are big. That's what I'm just saying. It's yeah. different from my country. Well, like, <laughs> all my friends were like, you're going to pick her up in your big old truck? <laughs> really? Yeah. I, I was going to try and borrow my roommate's car because it's smaller and it has like yes. you can obviously put better stuff in it um but he's in baltimore moving his friends so oh yeah. you get the big picture <laughs> oh that's all right well yeah it was very different in my country it was just really hot is it yeah really humid out there yes yeah. human it's definitely humid here but like in the bay area it, it'll, it'll get hot but it's more of a dry hot and thankfully you have the Pacific Ocean, so yeah. you get like the ocean breeze to cool down. <laughs> yeah. And it is funny because you'll you'll probably notice in the summer if you go to San Francisco at night, it's actually like they say the warmest winter I've ever spent is the summer in San Francisco. Wow. It like, gets so cold at night in San Francisco. Really? Yeah. That's so it'll nice. be good that you have this if you ever go. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. They don't sell this in my country. I know this one. I'm so like. Because I got paired up with Joshua from Uganda, and I was like, he's gonna get off the airplane at eight at night and freeze to death. Wow. Because he was <laughs> also having trouble finding anything down there. Yeah. But and if you have a cord and need a charge, you can plug it in. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, the, the problem is I don't is know. I don't know where I have it. Okay. <laughs> I have I have like three bags. Yeah. And I don't even know. I really hope. I think your bag is safe. Drive back. Let me. Uh... So I figured we can just drive to the. Um, the hospital so we can at least put your luggage somewhere dry yeah this is and like then that's kind of close to the black bag oh okay i was yeah. like oh my god <laughs> yeah and you're kind of close to like the white house so we can like walk around really oh, okay yeah and i have an umbrella oh here. i do have an umbrella too but just i don't know where somewhere yeah. <laughs> somewhere yeah and it's such a bummer that like the weather's like this because we could drive around and you can see like all the washington monuments and stuff. yeah yeah, I'll come back though. Yeah. When <laughs> that, you'll be here, when do you fly out to the bay? Um, I mean, I'm gonna fly to California yeah. on the 30th, I believe. Oh, okay. And then I will be back on January to Washington. Oh my goodness. Um, yeah. <laughs> and then you go back out to California? Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and then I go, um, I come back on May. Oh my gosh. And then I go back to California. That's so confusing. And then I come back to Washington in September. And then I go back to California for how long? And then that's the last one. And then I come back to Washington again in November. Here. So it's five times. So if you say five times and five times, that's yeah. like ten flights. So are you like staying like each month? You'll stay here. Here I'll be for one week only okay. because they're going to give us just like a global training or something, yeah, yeah, yeah. leadership training. But it, um, you know, my host organization is in Auckland, so that's where I will spend my my yeah. time. Yeah. I think you'll really like it out there. Like, DC is nice, but it's not like that diverse. I feel like like the Bay Area is a lot more diverse. Yeah. Um, it's definitely got the same traffic problems and the same problems like being expensive. But it is nice because we have like public transportation. So this right here is Metro. Oh, really? Yeah. I have never seen one of those. Yeah. Well, that's the thing is I was asking Zachary and I was like, oh, like, you know, what if I just picked her up at the airport, but we took Metro and See, he's like, no, she's gonna have too much luggage. And I was like, I mean, between the two of us, it's probably fine. But yeah. that way you can experience Metro. Yeah. Because um, out in San Francisco, they have the BART train. Yes. Very similar to Metro. I just wish there were like better <laughs> weather conditions for that too. Yeah. Because yeah, well, it's raining It'll heavily. It'll run. Really? Yeah. So out in this area, like more of the suburbs. It's, oh. It's above ground. Yeah. And then when you get like into Washington. And all those other oh. 
Yeah, on January and I mean on the other months that I will come again, I'm just gonna bring one. Yeah. Not three. I'm gonna leave the other ones yeah. in California. It'd be easier. Oh, definitely. <laughs> yeah. Well, that'll be cool because then you'll get to experience the different weather. Yeah. Like between here and the, they the were saying they were saying it's actually better that I'm I, going to oh, be yeah. freezing here, and then once I get to California, I'm gonna be like, oh. yeah, you're gonna be like, I don't need to here. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But right now, right now, right now is a chop. Right yeah, now. No, completely. Because yeah, when I first moved to Uganda, we moved there um, around like this time. And like for us, the holidays are obviously a lot colder. So we were all really confused like, what's going on? Yeah. Like, what is this? Yeah. Like, what is going on? Yeah. 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 Um, I lobby Congress for Peace Corps volunteers. So we just got a bill passed through Congress to like help our health care because it's not very good. Um, so, but it's nice because um, the midterms just happened, so like the transfer of power is happening. So I don't have a lot to do with work. Yeah. So I can I can volunteer. Oh, with that that's Corps. actually really cool. Yeah, it's nice. But Peace Corps is not like in every country. It's only here. No, no. It's so. What happens is countries that were in they asked Peace Corps to come so like Uganda said Peace Corps will you come and help with education oh. or a business so it's like, like a help. but it's like a program for us in a specific a US, time yeah yeah like you go for two years so oh the metro, the oh wow so Atlas Corps is kind of like a reverse Peace Corps yeah so um, and it was actually started by a Peace Corps volunteer um, Scott the CEO yes um, Which is kind of funny because when I was in Peace Corps, me and my girlfriend were like, why don't we have people like in Peace Corps countries go to the U.S. to like study your work? And somebody had already thought of that, I guess. Yeah. With Atlas Corps. So when I heard about it, I was like, ooh, I want to volunteer with Atlas Corps. Because, you know, I think it's great that we get to go to these countries, but I think it's even better that you guys get to come here. Yeah. Yeah, like, it's, like he said, opportunity, it's different yeah. for, like, people but talent is everywhere yeah.